Hi, welcome to another vlog. I wasn't planning on vlogging. I don't have a dot of makeup on, but I'm going for a walk and I'll take you guys with me, I guess. I'm so cold, it's insane, and I have a ton of layers on. <laughs> this is so depressing. Mm. How cute are these? So cute. Everything is too cute. Look at these erasers. This sucks. There's a mini pool table. How cute. Losing time, I'm fading fast. I just want to make it last. Try to let go of the past. I close my eyes, embrace the blast. Sleepless nights and headaches stack. Restlessness to hell and back. What's my purpose? What do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack. I'm back, but it's so beautiful. I've been sitting here for like two minutes just taking on the sun. I know sometimes I come off as crazy. I'm aware and I'm home <sighs> look at me I just don't understand how I'm supposed to always keep my hair looking nice but also wear beanie and sweat all the time <sighs> and this time it's fine because I actually took off my beanie in the store but <sighs> still man still look at this It's fine. It's fine. I'm thinking about ordering food, but I don't know. Should I? I know I shouldn't, but look at my cheeks from the cold. That sunscreen is really sticky. Ugh. I'm just wearing this cheap sunscreen that I want to review to order food or not to order food that is the question i guess you guys will know in a few if i do end up ordering and uh, please don't order i'm gonna order i know i'm going to do it it's like the devil and the the angel okay first let me show you what i got honestly it's nothing crazy i just went to the dollar store i did want to go to staples or what is it here? Bureau en gros, I think. Um, but when I got in, I saw the person in front of me giving their vaccine passport. So I didn't go in because I forgot my actual physical passport. That's the only way to show them that I have the vaccine because um, it, come, it has my paper, my Lebanon paper vaccine thing in it. I don't have a QR code here. So yeah, anyway, I got myself a sketchbook. It's been a while. Oh, there's this. I think I got scammed. But it's fine. It was only $5. But this guy just poked me and then gave me this card. It says, excuse me, I'm a deaf person selling these cards. For a living, pay any price. Thank you for your kindness. God bless you. Oh, and on the back, there's the alphabet for the deaf. See? So that was interesting. I did give him, obviously, some cash because we have this. I mean, I don't know. In Lebanon, I would never. But he gave me the alphabet. I just got blinded <laughs> anyway moving on i got a nail brush just for the back of my nails because i'm really picky with them i keep picking at them and making sure they're clean and stuff so i figured the brush would help i got just um an adhesive notepad because when i'm taking courses i like to take notes and i don't like them 
I like my stuff really organized, so sometimes I get um, a bit OCD about my notebook. So having sticky notes, big ones, that I can move and replace and stuff is going to be easier for me. I also got sketching pencils, just a pack of 12. I spent like an hour looking at pens and pencils and markers and stuff. I, I didn't know what to get. The problem is, is that I couldn't remember what I used to use at home. Like, what did I draw with? I need to look at some old drawings to figure out what I use. I'm pretty sure I didn't use pencils, but they didn't have the like ink pens that I used to draw with, the architecture ones. I'm used to those, but that's why I wanted to go to Staples. Bureau en gros, you're in Quebec. Um, I don't know why I keep, I keep saying Staples because uh, the course I'm uh, taking, it's about like digital marketing and stuff. And they were talking, there was a whole thing about the Staples logo and advertising and stuff. So it's stuck in my head, but it's Bureau en gros for sure. I feel like I'm saying that weird. Bureau en gros. Anyway, finally, I just got a pencil sharpener for the pencils. And that's about it. Now, should I order food? Uh, the fact that I'm hiding my double chin the whole time. It means that I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to. While I'm here, I'm going to add some clips from the first few days when I came to Canada. That was months ago, I know. But I just didn't want to delete the clips and not have them anywhere on my channel. I want to keep the memories. So I figured uh, I'll add them right now. I did edit them a while ago, but I completely forgot about it for some reason. And didn't end up making it its own vlog. So I'll just show you what I did right now. Oh, and I have the little Oh, this is our old house. We're getting some gas for the car. Puppy, but you know, this is my father. Father. So I'm so weird that oh, who are they being romantically and cute? Romantically and cute. Wow, English. Uh, this is how people get gas. Mish mitlna. Kifak fawl. Oh. My dad and my sister are unloading her bed into her house and they're struggling and I'm just sitting here I offered to help they said I should stay in the car <laughs> look at them struggling <laughs> Poor father. We are. We are. <laughs> Back to me. It's so cold. It's not even funny. I don't even have a jacket. But hopefully, I'll get one today. I'm supposed to be, I guess, looking out for the car. So we're not supposed to be parked here. And don't judge what I'm wearing. I barely packed any clothes because the makeup was so heavy. <laughs> you look like little shite. Shite. We are at Time Out Market. I guess we're going to eat here. It's like a big food court. I'll show you in a sec. Uh, it's so aesthetically pleasing. Ooh. 
We got the food. This is poutine, chicken poutine with the, what is it? Chorizo. Chorizo. Um, this is from Campo. And these are some tacos with guac and oh my god, they look so pretty. Okay, let's eat. We're hungry. Okay, don't judge how I look. It's cold but hot at the same time. You sweat and you freeze and I don't know. Oh my double chin. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to keep you here for long. We just finished eating. If I use these clips, you would have seen us eating, but she's making fun of me, but we demolished the food. There's nothing left. We're at Sephora. Yeah, it's so cute. It's tiny. I'm getting this Kizu hair set. Yeah. This set, it has a hair oil, shampoo, conditioner, and a hair mask. And we're getting Mira a Charlotte Tilbury powder. Exciting. I kind of want to try that too. We're just waiting in line. We stopped for a break after Sephora at this little cafe. I get tired. I'm not used to the walking. I got an iced uh, latte. She got a cold brew. <laughs> She's adding more coffee to mine. Because mine is like milk. It's a latte, but I don't know. Yeah, the color kind of darkens. And I don't know. Should I do we're finally at my sister's and that was exhausting <laughs> but i guess we're going to chill here and then i'm gonna go home maybe help her build a bed i'm just sat here having some water how cute are her cups Well, there's no other choice and I'm not bringing it back and I'm not buying another bed. I don't give a shit. <laughs> break under me i do not the thing is and you know, after we did the whole thing we realized you know if you can see the feet of the bed don't even touch the floor which is hilarious and we're done and we're exhausted but this is the bed and it looks nice if you follow my instagram you know how stupid this window was to clean every time i sprayed the the cleaning thing it would freeze it would freeze on the actual outside window um so i had to use my blow dryer to melt the cleaning product so i can wipe it off that took an hour it's one window it took an hour i also washed the curtains they're a bit wrinkly tried to steam them didn't work don't have the patience for it and if you can hear the washing machine going off it's because I have my bedding in there. This is everything stripped down. I have everything that's supposed to go on my floors up on my desk so I can hoover later. Wiped the dust and did the mirror in the stupid bathroom. Obviously got a candle there. And yeah, I'll show you the room when it's clean and fresh. Oh, I also have food. I'm cooking. I have food on the stove. I'm making mashed potatoes and meatballs. Um, I guess I should probably check on these. Excuse me, washing machine. Rude. Rude. Yeah, I should probably uh, do something about this. I still have a lot to do, honestly. Every time I speak, do you mind? Do you mind shutting up? Thank you. Yeah, I'm just waiting to hoover and clean the floors and and the dust off of like my bedside table and this thing um, till I'm done and my bed is made because this guy the duvet thing uh, it just poofs fluff everywhere. You can kind of see the floors; they're covered with like white feathers and stuff um so it's really annoying so i'm going to make the bed and everything let it settle and then 
clean the floors and vacuum oh my god look at me i look horrible but it's fine i've been cleaning all day since 11 a.m it's now like 2 or 3 p.m and i still have a lot left i'm just waiting for um my bed stuff to come out of the dryer so uh it's been a lot and this is like the worst part of not living at home it's the cleaning it's the cooking and for some reason we had a whole conversation by the way my sister and i about how much dust this country or the way they built provides you it just gets so dusty so quickly it's not fun That was just two corners. I'm out of breath. And that wasn't even the hard part. Ugh, I need to fill the duvet cover with the duvet. Ugh. And that's it I'm done floors are clean let me know if you'd like an in-depth room tour just comment in the comment section and I am NOT opposed to filming one anyway I have to go check on the food everything's cooking nicely I'm gonna have a shit ton of dishes to do I just don't get it who likes this who enjoys this and like an hour or two after I made the bed, the food is ready. I'm so hungry, I hope it tastes good. And I do have leftovers. To be honest, not the best. Definitely not worth all the work and the dishes I'm going to have to do, but it's fine, it's fine. I'll eat it. So that's it. I know this vlog has been all over the place, but if you enjoyed it, please like the video, subscribe to my channel, and click on the notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. I don't know why I keep doing this. Bye-bye. I'll see you in the next one.